my name is Kaz and welcome to my Minecraft custom map review. Today we are looking at the custom map Destroy the Diamond Comet created by Mungible901. The version I used was 2.5. Story. It's a bit of a strange story. A giant diamond comet is on its way to Earth and you as the scientist who discovered it have to destroy the comet before it crashes. But rich people who want to harvest the comet try to stop you. The story is a bit simplistic and sometimes it can be a bit confusing. Luckily nodes are well placed in the map and the flow of the story isn't interrupted nor neglected so you can still enjoy it despite its shortcomings. The atmosphere of impending doom is really well carried over the course of the map and it will make you want to hasten your steps. Creativity The facility and the different rooms are well crafted and some of them are combined with their story exceptionally creative. Variety Even so, the map is set in a facility the different rooms look really diverse. They range from normal rooms to being destroyed by parts of the comet and lava flooded. The puzzles are nicely done, don't get repetitive and are really varied. Difficulty This map is made on peaceful, so only puzzles can be your doom. The difficulty level is in general on easy. Only the lava bits are a bit more trickier. In the case of this map, I don't really think that being easy is a negative thing. All of the puzzles, with the exception of one at the beginning, are intuitive and with a bit of thought easily to figure out. More on that in the conclusion. Random stuff. Two great features make this map less frustrating. The first one is a checkpoint system, or more to the point a bed, that is placed at lava parts. The second one is a minecart that transports your items before you attempt lava parts. Conclusion Destroy the Diamond Comet is a really interesting map. The story is a bit weak, in return the atmosphere is even greater. The puzzles are easy but that intuitive that I would say that this is one of the best maps for someone who wants to start with custom maps. The frustration is kept at the minimum because of the minecart and checkpoint system so new players won't quit because they died. Last but not least the map takes around 35 minutes to complete. A great length for a beginner or for between times. That's about it. I hope that you like my little review, that my German accent isn't that annoying and most importantly that I could help you decide if you want to play this map. My name is Cass and I hopefully see you next time. Please.